I and my staff ha had gone to the Apollo Theater to watch him perform on Amateur Night, I think it was called, uh, seated somewhere in the third tier of the Apollo Theater. Uh, clearly, we were uh, not prepared for the uh, vociferous way that we should react to, to watching Danian uh, perform. He brought the house down, there's no question about it. Um, he was extremely, extremely good at what he had done. Um, uh, clearly, we thought he was the best performer of the night. Uh, uh, sadly, he didn't win, even though in our minds uh, he had won and then beyond. Uh, it's interesting from the standpoint of having that type of intimate interaction and surgical interaction with a patient, but watching someone of Danian's ability after you've performed multiple surgeries on really the, the central functioning component of their body and behavior pattern uh, is, is gratifying. Uh, to watch the symmetry of movement, to watch the coordination of, of talent, uh, and to watch the auditory and the vocalizations that he was capable of uh, are really amazing on a lot of levels that we put together a team here at the New York Presbyterian Hospital of anesthesiologists, intensivists, surgeons, neurologists, pediatricians, who are basically invested in that care and take somebody who's from a near comatose state to performing on a, you know, a central theater uh, uh, you know, above all else in, in the United States is pretty, uh, pretty impressive. Um, it's motivating, it's moving on, on many levels.